Hello, hello everyone. I'm here with Ethel and Beans, petite size double doodles. And this is our puppy picking video. So um, you can probably notice that this is more of an, a voiceover, which it is. That is not me sitting there with the babies right now. That is my daughter, Jessica. And she is gonna be the one to show us the babies this week and maybe even next week um, because I just got out of the hospital from spinal surgery and sitting on the floor is not going to happen. As a matter of fact, just getting out of bed is, is a challenge. So um, I, I was watching this video um, last night after Jessica did it in the afternoon and um, clearly she has grown up with the babies. Um, this has been her life. She was born into <laughs> the doodle breeding life. Look at you. Look at that baby. Oh my goodness. So anyway, she is pretty much doing everything I do. She plays with the puppies every day. So um, she kind of has a good handle on, on what's going on here. But um, this is a litter of six. We have three boys, three girls, and they're just, um, just so incredibly beautiful. It's hard to tell, um, you know, a, 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 who's prettier than the other because they all have their own special little something that makes them absolutely phenomenal look at that baby that is purple girl and she is the lightest color of the litter she's kind of got short little ears but she's got that beautiful teddy bear face so she's still considered a red or a dark peanut butter and right there is the curly one of the litter that's light pink collar girl look at that face look at that little chocolate nose we have a lot of chocolate noses in here hey baby that is red collar boy yeah I mean he is so sweet and then there's orange collar boy he is a super dark dark look at red red and purple they're gonna yeah <laughs> she's got personality look at her go look at her there's little orangey and he's another dark dark one look at you <laughs> so the three girls are the turquoise light pink and purple and then the boys here, we've got red and orange. And then oh, we should have a green around here. Where is he? Where is green? Where am I missing him? Is he right over there? See, this is hard being on the, this end. I now understand, guys. Totally understand. You're sitting here looking around. Where'd they go? Is that him right there? Go back. Go back. Now that's orange. Purple. Turquoise. <laughs> look at that. Turquoise has that beautiful lab look with the eyes. Absolutely gorgeous. Yes. Pretty girl. Let's see who's on the bench. I'm thinking he's on the bench. So other than light pink collar girl, everybody else is a wavy coat. That wavy is still um, a, a kind of a curly coat. It's still a ragamuffin shaggy look. And that cotton is that, um, uh, for those who are gonna be coming and feeling, there he is, green. There you are, buddy. I wonder if she'll let, let us see his face. Can you turn him around, Jess? You think she'll do it? Maybe, maybe not. She's just wanting to play with him. Maybe she'll hold him up for me later. But you can see she, okay, now, nope, she didn't correct that one. Right now they're starting to get to um, a point where they're starting to um, nibble a little bit. And that's what doodles do. They have got sensitive, super sensitive teeth and they have to relieve um, or alleviate that pain by chewing. And it's also their way of just um, investigating. So, um, you know, it's, it's one thing that it's not a bad thing. It's not a bad quality. It's a normal quality. We just have to realize that we need to show them, no, we're not gonna chew on these items, but yes, you can choose on those items, or chew on those items. So uh, the items we don't want them to chew on is fingers, you know, toes, that sort of thing. So they're now starting to get really interested in that. Look at them, look at them. They're all super, super sweet, but you can see they're playful too. They're doing their plaything. Oh, look at you, look at you, buddy. There's little, so I guess um, purple's gonna be the lightest color. She's got a chocolate nose too. 
And then green's gonna be the next lightest after her. And then, but they go, this is like a really super deep red, almost the darkest reds. Um, a lot of people comment, oh, that looks like a beautiful chocolate dog. And you know, uh, the red is a, a, a light chocolate. So I can see where uh, some of our double doodles that go home can certainly get super dark and almost look like that chocolate color. So um, totally see where that's coming from. But uh, anyway, so our um, temperament testing is going to be coming out on Monday. You'll get that probably towards evening, but you'll at least get it a few days before picking. And then um, I have everybody confirmed for their picking spots. Um, I, I believe everybody on this litter has confirmed with me. So you're picking on Wednesday, the 27th. And um, just uh, look at the directions that I gave you there. And you're going to go to that little yellow building with all the stairs. And uh, you'll be able to sit down. We try to limit um, your top two picks. That's what we want you to choose is your top two picks to go in there and um, play with. If you get too many puppies at one time, it can get a little overwhelming, um, not just for you, but then the puppies. They just start running around and you're not able to really get that time with them and, and, and get a good um, feel on their temperament. There they go. There they go. Oh, I gotta take a drink, guys. Oh, goodness. So I'm actually recording this, looking at this video in my bed. Um, I am able to walk, I am home now but it's still quite challenging. But um, I think it's been a great thing so that I can go ahead and start getting down on the floor without being in so much pain. So I'm looking forward. I miss these babies. Um, being in the hospital for three days, I really, really miss these babies. So uh, I, I, I feel like I'm at least getting some time with them right now just by being on the video. <laughs> but anyway, they're in the chocolate donut. We, we should have some of those donuts left in our store, in our... Um, online store for those that are picking up if you do order something from the store just choose uh in-person pickup and then we'll have your order ready for you when you come pick up puppy that way you're not paying a shipping fee look we got on the purple block yay yay buddy all right guys i am going to let you just kind of watch them and they're gonna play for you and i will see the rest of you guys at puppy picking i can't believe it it's already here all right we'll see you next week or this week yeah, we'll see you Wednesday.